Hi, my name is Keith White. I'm an FTD education consultant and I'm here to share a variety of tips about merchandising for the holiday with you. And of course, looking at this particular setting, I've chosen Valentine's and using FTD codified in product containers. When you're using containers and offering uh, different choices for the consumer, market the best, offer the less. This is one of those things that people forget to do. They only think, oh, they want to limit their sales. So again, market the best, offer the less. But again, you want to have something that's going to gravitate that person to the area or to your products that will truly, again, no pun intended, romance the product. Bold and beautiful. Get their attention with something like this uh, particular heart that's made out of the gypsophilia, studded in with uh, some of the brooches, rhinestone brooches and also including items like the ribbon or other uh, rhinestone brooches that can help, again, enhance that romancing the product, which will help increase average order values by these little add-on products that are kind of like a silent salesperson. The customer sees it and then has to have it. Again, signage and graphics play an important role in merchandising. So if you're offering the different items, you'll be able to have the signage say special, never use the word sale if you're offering products uh, like the two dozen roses. Have those as your special instead of what normally everyone has a dozen roses, have your two dozen roses at a special price and those will increase your average order values, being able to upsell and upscale the different products you have available uh, for Valentine's Day. Thank you for joining me today and for more floral business and design tips, visit ftdi.com.